It's the last day of fishing for muskies on Eagle Lake and my everything hurts. What's going on everybody? My name is Brian, you're watching Angling Anarchy and yes, it is the seventh day of our week-long musky opener here in Eagle Lake in Ontario and it started off with a bang. Jim and I got three fish the first morning, the first day we were here, and I thought, this is gonna be easy. And then the muskies decided to not make it easy. The second day we got a couple, lost a couple, and since then we have really been on the struggle bus. Losing fish, not seeing nearly as many fish as we usually do, uh, but we had cold temps rolling into this and really high water conditions, which didn't help matters at all. We now have anywhere from 62 to 65 on most of the lake. So uh, we've seen the weeds go from maybe five feet off the bottom to eight feet now. They've grown just in the, in the past week that we've been here. So lots of changes. The only thing that hasn't changed is that muskies still suck a lot of the times. So um, we've got a mix of rain, sun. We're probably gonna get kicked off the lake by three or four with some big storms this afternoon. So we have a little bit of time to make something happen. We've got a nice vast weed bed that we are going to just pick apart. We're just gonna pick one piece of structure. We know there's fish here. We've saw them, uh, we saw some the other day. So we're just gonna throw whatever baits we can at them, see if we can get them to hit, and see if we can put a muskie or maybe a pike. There's, there's plenty of pike in here too in the boat for you. So let's get after it. All right, folks, I'm gonna throw this trilogy that I kind of built myself. It's, I don't know. I got the blade uh, from Scott and made my own trilogy. So that's what I'm throwing, sort of a killer corn type color, walleye pattern, whatever. Uh, I'm throwing it on a 9.6 SWAT 2020 assault stick with a 400 tranks. I'll be alternating between this and maybe like a Navin and stuff. We're gonna be fishing weeds. Jim's got, let's take a look at Jim's bait. Jim's got a fancy little walleye five inch Mini X, Custom X Mini X with a killer tail on the back. So he's throwing that on a, what do you got there? Surgical strike? Surgical strike, Surgical strike with a 401 Tranks. That's what we got rolling today. Hopefully we can catch something before the storms kick us off the lake. Fish? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Big pike, big pike. Huh. Yeah. Huh. Boy, eat the heck out of that thing. Yeah. Oh jeez. Stop it. Stop it. Seven. Yeah, just let him go. Yeah? Okay. Yeah. Well, All right. Him, All right. <laughs> Tried splashing me, but I stopped that. And now it's raining. Fish. Right, 
coming right here. Oh, it's just another big pike. That's just a big pike, though. <laughs> Jeez. Oh, it's a, just a day of big pike, I guess. Take a, yeah, yeah. We'll get a look at that guy. Maybe if he stays in the net, that might be another forty there, potentially. All right. Undo yourself. Yeah, 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 yeah. All right. Let's see. Let's. Oh, almost got it, almost got it. Ah, man. He did not want to let go of that. All right, let's see here. All right. I don't know if that, it's got the head to look like a 40, but I don't know if it's gonna go all that way. All right. Boy, that's a th another thick pike. Yeah, Jim had a 37. No, we're not going to touch 40 this time. Just, just a hair over 38. But man, uh, fat pike had me thinking we were in business there for a second. Oh, slimy sucker. All right. Well, tell one of your brown buddies to hit next time. There he goes. All right, well, two big pike on the board, no muskies yet, but we've still got some time before the storms hit us. Hey, there's a muskie. Yeah, <laughs> kind of popped up on it and then gave up on it. All right, well. Yep, shot right up to it and then said, no thanks. No, 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 but it came up after it. It just didn't stick with it. Another pike. <laughs> I thought we were in business there, yeah. Rip up and <laughs> Oh, Mr. Pikey again. Well. Yeah, I'll put him on there, just... Well, it's funny, because he's got, like... Yeah, yeah. It seemed browner, and it seemed all funky. Oh, <laughs> there we go. All right. Ready to go? All right. Let's see here. Let's take a look at what we thought was Jim's muskie and turned out to be Jim's pike. Our third big pike of the day. Probably another upper 30s here. Yeah, probably so. A little beat up looking. I'm not sure what that's all about, but yeah, she is 
another one of those just just shy of 37 man two 37s and a 38 pike that's not exactly muskies but it's sort of exciting nope. yeah i even tried to keep you from doing that and couldn't do it <laughs> uh, i don't know we just we just got the pike skunk in the boat i guess which it's better than not catching anything but uh, a muskie sure would be nice pretty soon here well, unfortunately, I think we have to uh, throw up the white flag and uh, call uncle, or however you want to euphemistically say, give up. Um, we've got, it doesn't look like it, but we're supposed to have weather coming in. We've got to pack up the boat and get ready for the drive back to Wisconsin. It's about a 11, 12 hour drive. So that's what we're gonna do. Get some food, clean up, wash up, all the fun, well, all the not fun stuff that you have to do when a trip comes to an end. But another, Amazing trip to Eagle Lake. I love coming here, even though sometimes, just like this time, it will kick your butt. I don't care if it's Canada and people think fish jump in the boat, you still gotta work for them. Uh, as a group, all the people we're fishing with, 48 and a half was the biggest, a uh, bunch of 47s, 46s, and some really nice pike. So, that's it. Um, thanks everyone for watching all these Canada videos. We've got more stuff coming up this summer. We've got some river floats. We've got another Canada trip in August, which I'm very much looking forward to already. That's what you have to look forward to. So, if you wouldn't mind, I don't ask this often, please subscribe, hit the like button, all that fun stuff. I would appreciate it. With that, I will see you all in the next video. Thanks everyone for watching. Bye.